Kane is in the building. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome uh, to the Tech Temple. Thanks again for checking out this video. I know I'm late in uh, introducing a new one, but I uh, tried to get a new camera and didn't get around to it, so I'm back on the same one as before. So hopefully I can get a clearer one. But uh, yeah, I know I was said I was going to show you guys a tour of 2.2 uh, on the Hero. I'm using a Cyanogen, Cyanogen mod, and also uh, used, you are using a a theme from uh, that I found on XDA and I'll post a link to that um, in the notes in the comments but uh, so yeah the, the one that I have makes it kinda look like the Galaxy S series but aside from the look of it everything else will get when you just normally put on Cyanogen mod um, so first thing I'll show you guys is the um, the bar at the bottom I'm using Launcher Pro and I have the paid version but for the paid version you don't need to pay to get this. All you have to pay is to get the uh, the widgets. But yeah, this is a nice feature of the um, drawer. So you can set it to continuously go or you can stop it when you get to the end. But over from here, you can make calls, um, view your contacts. There's the app drawer, 10 text messages, and email. And the email and the text message show you how many you have unread. So that's always nice. You don't have to go into the app or you don't have to worry about notification up there. Um, on the left, I have the people that I uh, contact the most. So I have my family and the two people that I uh, text the most, which is nice. You can just hit the button. And instead of going into the app to to use the to text them, you just hit that, and then it should uh, it opens up right there. So that's pretty handy. And on the other side, uh, you can set all these icons to however you want to. Um, right now, I have web camera music player, navigation, and the camera. So I'll show you guys a little bit. Um, yeah, Launcher Pro is pretty much the, it's making all this look like this. I'll just go through the home screens real fast. I have five, you can pick between three or five. I'll start from the left. Here's the power control widgets to turn off things like Wi-Fi, um, data on and off, um, the sound, and brightness, and lock airplane mode, so you don't have to go back into the settings to do it. Um, here's the calendar. If you Originally, remember on your hero, you had HTC Sense. Um, the widgets in Launcher Pro look pretty much exactly like HTC Sense, so that's always nice. Like right here, I got the calendar widget. Um, it's still smooth; it's not not laggy at all. In addition to this calendar view, you can also do the um, the list view. That gets you to the list view, so you can see everything. And here you have the weather and the news. So you can click on the weather, and the weather will it'll use your location uh, if you choose, and it shows you the the temperature. And it also is nice because you can go uh, minute by minute to show by dragging the bar to show what you uh, what time you like to view. So that's always nice. And you can go to top stories, um, U.S. news sports news or entertainment news and next screen the widget I have my Facebook so it's nice you don't have to actually use the Facebook app that's included on here you can just uh, get this from Launcher Pro and it's nice like it scrolls scrolls pretty fast so you can see everything if you have Twitter there's another uh, widget the friends widget and it shows Facebook and Twitter and one more I believe but this is nice you can um, update your status from here Pressing this right, right through there, or you can uh, hit the Facebook word right there, and that should take you right to the Facebook app. So even if you, um, there's still a quick way to get to the Facebook app, even if you don't um, have the widget. And lastly, I got my uh, Last FM and my uh, Greed 2, the free version, Greed Light which uh, is pretty much as an RSS reader and um, yeah, like I said the web the app market uh, navigation and music the only thing about music on that I've noticed with at least on this uh, 
the cyanogen for on this hero. The music player slows down the phone a little bit, so it's kind of hard to multitask while you have the music running. So what I did, I just I would just recommend using a, another party, another app for your music player. Um, this app right here is called Cubed. You just type in three in the market and it should come up. Um, but yeah, I'll put a link on that. But it's nice because you can. It's actually like a, like a little little cube instead of. It's like I haven't really seen anything like this before, especially for music. So that's a, another cool little thing. And one other, one other cool thing I like about this is the clock. It's a lot. It's a little better than the two point one version. Uh, from the clock, you can dim it. You can bring it back up. Um, you can go to your um, your alarm. So one thing I want to show you is the uh, the slideshow is kind of nice. It, go, it goes through all the pictures that you have on your uh, SD card. I got a lot of background stuff on mine, so it kind of just transitions. So that's pretty nice. And the gallery is really cool in 2.2. Um, it's got it's 3D. Um, the background is nice because it goes off the backgrounds that you have loaded in your gallery. And I mean, it's pretty slick. It moves pretty fast. I like the picture, so it's taking a little bit. But um, it goes landscape and it goes portrait. So it goes both ways. Um, and if you also notice another thing that it's kind of cool. Um, the background kind of you see if you can see the pictures kind of go with the way that you turn the phone. I mean, it's not useful, but it's cool to sh it's cool to show off. And also got a voice search. So if you want to text someone just from your voice, I can show you guys that. Text Chris Davis. What's up? And it'll run through what you just said. And it's pretty fast. It says right there, Chris Davis. And I said, what's up? So that's pretty cool. And it also works for if you want to find restaurants or I'm trying to find anything else on the map or do a Google search. That's all through the voice. And another cool thing about this is uh, the app drawer. You can make a 3D app drawer using Launcher Pro. So you can see it's 3D. And also it has apps to SD. So you can save some space on your phone. Uh, that's in the settings. I'll show you how to get there. It's in um, Cyanogen Mod Settings, and then you go to Application Settings at the, at the top, and you click Allow Application Moving and check it, and you should be able to move your apps to a SD. It won't move it all the way to the SD card. It'll move it like as much as it can. If you format your SD, um, if you partition it, then you could do the whole thing, the whole app to the SD. But here's all the Cyanogen Mod Settings. You can change the color like this app drawer. You can change um, the color like you can make this black. You can make it change to any color you want to. You can change the time. You can change all these little words up here, the colors. Like you can customize it a lot. So that's what I like about the Cyanogen mod. Besides, it's also really fast. So you can see like scrolling is real fast. Um, the dollars definitely improved from the original Hero version. Um, if you go to the, um, here's a phone I can just show you guys. I ran a phone number, but it goes real fast. You don't have to worry about call lag. Um, it shows all your contacts. It's really smooth. Instead of scrolling like this, you can also scroll um, by letter. So it's always nice. And then at the end, you also have your favorite people that you call the most often. And it's got, um, it's got all the Google apps on here. Once you flash the actual Cyanogen mod ROM and on top of that, flash the Google apps. So you can get uh, the Chrome to phone. I'll make a video about that later. And um, like all the other Gmail or Gmail's in there and all the other Google apps are also included. 
Um, there's also uh, you also might want to put Sprint TV back on, and also this visual voicemail. Uh, I have links for that also if you want to install that on your uh, on your device. So yeah, that's uh, 2.2 um, wrapped up. If you guys had any questions or how I did this, or you want to know where I got stuff, I'll try to put most of the links down um, underneath the video. So uh, yeah, if you got any questions, feel free to post them in the comments, and I'll I'll definitely answer them like I usually do. So thanks to you guys for watching. This has been uh, another adventure on the the Tech Temple. Hope you guys well, like. really trying to fuck with Hollywood co. I'm with Molly G, bro. Flying Holly Grow chicks to my Hollywood shows. And I want to tell you something that you probably should know. This that slum dog millionaire Bollywood flow. And uh, my real friends never hear it from me. Fake friends write the wrong answers on the mirror for me. That's why I pick and choose.